Hey, it's Danny from Conscious Calisthenics here. So I want to share with you all why I am now doing bodybuilding alongside calisthenics with my weekly workout routine. And yeah, I always want to be completely transparent with people and tell you what's going on with my own evolution. And things are always changing with my diet and my workout programs and supplementation because yeah, I'm always testing out new things and just seeing what results I can get. So the reason why I am now combining bodybuilding with calisthenics is really, really simple. I wanna gain quite a bit more muscle mass. And yes, you can do it with calisthenics, but doing calisthenics with bodybuilding, from what I've looked into, you can get results a lot, lot quicker. Because yeah, obviously with bodybuilding, you can add a lot of additional weight to your body. And what I've found is with so many of my calisthenics idols that I've watched over the years, so many of them just show you that they do calisthenics. But when you do further research into a lot of them, a lot of them are also doing bodybuilding behind the scenes, but they don't show you in their Instagram and YouTube videos the majority of the time because it doesn't look as good. And I found that, yeah, the people that are doing calisthenics with bodybuilding seem to have the most muscle mass possible. So, yeah, I have been modifying my workouts. So I'm doing about 50% bodybuilding with 50% weighted calisthenics. So I'm pretty much doing no non-weighted calisthenics at all anymore. It is all pretty much weighted calisthenics, like 90% weighted calisthenics out of all the calisthenics that I'm doing, and then 50% bodybuilding. So you could say 50% bodybuilding, 40% weighted calisthenics, and about 10% non-weighted calisthenics. And what I can say from the last week of doing this, that I'm noticing that my muscles are aching so much more than they ever have done in the past. And I've always done specific hypertrophy training where I train to failure with every single exercise. But I'm telling you, wow, I'm definitely noticing some significant differences combining the weighted calisthenics with the bodybuilding exercises. And what I say is I'm hardly using any machines. I'm doing mostly compound exercises with some isolated bodybuilding exercises. And so far, I am enjoying it. And yeah, I will just continue on this path and yeah, take progressive photos over time and I also show you a transformation over a year from this point forward of my body transformation we're using calisthenics with bodybuilding but who knows maybe I won't even get to a year period from where I'm at now with this type of working out I might get bored with it it might not work for me but yeah it's working for me very very well at the moment and I'm very excited to see the differences that I get from combining these two together. And you know that you're gonna get the best muscle growing benefits when your muscles are aching the most that they possibly can ache for the longest duration. So I'm finding that it is making my muscles actually ache for around five days really, really intensely, which was happening with calisthenics quite a few times, but I'm finding that doing it with bodybuilding now, instead of just calisthenics, they're aching even more. And it seems to be using my muscles in a different way compared to calisthenics. And what I say is my own personal experience with calisthenics. For example, doing leg workouts, it's only so far that you can go without using weights. But then once you start doing calisthenics exercises, such as one-legged pistol squats and standard squats and all these other different types of leg exercises with weight added, so you've got loads of loads of additional strain on your muscles, it's going to help maximize your muscle growing, especially once you're in that recovery period. Because the more weight you're adding to your body, the more you're fatiguing the muscle, the more you're tearing the muscle, and then the more the muscles will grow. And the brilliant thing with bodybuilding is there's a lot of new things for me to learn. And I always love learning new things. So yeah, it is getting me out of my comfort zone and it is pushing me to learn growing both in a different way with my training than I have done in the past. So yeah, that's it for this video. If you have any questions, leave them down below as always and I get back to you as possible. If you like the video, like it down below, give us a thumbs up and please share this video with anyone that you think would love to hear about why I'm now combining bodybuilding with calisthenics and more specifically, mostly weighted calisthenics. And if you haven't already, click that subscribe button down below to receive a lot more videos from me on a regular basis where I'm talking about my own calisthenics 
journey and also now my bodybuilding journey. Also, I will be posting a lot of videos like I have done in the past on a regular basis, talking about one meal a day and intermittent fasting, also eating a plant-based diet. Also, I will be making many videos like I have in the past that are specifically calisthenics workout and progression videos and also calisthenics beginner videos to help you get into calisthenics like I've managed to and transformed my body fitness levels and my energy levels at the same time. So if those type of videos sound good to you and you want to be notified of when the new videos are uploaded, make sure you click that subscribe button down below and you click that bell notification button next to the subscribe button so YouTube notify you of when new videos are uploaded. Otherwise, they will not if you do not click that bell notification button after you click that subscribe button. So as always, stay fit, stay energetic and go and get those gains. Peace.